okay, so you're hearing a lot about this JSON format, and it's something you're going to have to be good at editing. So let's learn a little bit more about what it is. So JSON is an acronym for JavaScript Object Notation. It's not a programming language, but it's used heavily by programmers that need to send and receive data. So it's a data interchange format. The cool thing about JSON is that it's a format that's easy for humans to read, and it's also easy for computers to manipulate. Since it is used by computers to communicate data, the structure and the format are critically important. So while it's not a programming language, it will take a good programmer's eye for detail to work with JSON. Once you master this data format through all the fun things you'll be doing with Minecraft add-ons, you'll be proficient in a skill that will be helpful when you become a programmer in the future. If you'd like to read more about JSON, I'll provide a link down below. Let's go ahead right now and step through some of the terminology in the JSON format. So first of all, it starts over here with an object. So this sheep object is contained within the entire, within the entire file. So this entire thing is a JSON object. And inside of these curly braces are members. So you can see here that inside this curly brace is a member called format versions. You see members contain pairs. So you could see here a, a name and a value. So you see pairs have a string and a value in them. So this object contains a member that has a pair that is defining format version equal to a value of 0 0.1. Okay, similar, similar scenario here is that this member contains an object that contains members. So these are nested inside of each other. And one more detail is an array. An array is basically a list of values. So you see here, instead of just one position, inside these square brackets, it has a list of positions. So we have three different positions as the value for the position pair. Now this terminology is good to know, but it's not super important. We're not gonna be using the terminology through the entire training but it's good for you to understand how the format is structured so you understand how JSON files need to read. The formatting here is super important and this is gonna be valuable for us to understand how to make the changes that we want to create our awesome add-on. You can refer back to this section or look at the website if you wanna learn more about JSON if you get stuck at any point along the way.